Hello everyone Welcome back to my video How are you guys? I hope you are in a good condition during this pandemic In this video, I will provide important information regarding to data privacy So, before that, don't forget to like, comment, and share this video Enjoy watching! The importance of maintaining the security of data privacy in the digitalization era. The digital environment has become a complex environment, especially in terms of rights and responsibilities of users. Digital citizens need to be aware and understand their own online rights and responsibilities in order to not infringe the rights and responsibilities of others. Digital rights and responsibilities entails having the right to use any and all digital technologies while using it. In the digital age, data plays a huge role in our everyday lives. Privacy is a broad concept referring to the condition which enable a basic foundation of human dignity and autonomy. Data protection is more specific. It's concerned with the ways third parties handle the information they hold about us, how it is collected, processed, shared, stored, and used. In other words, privacy is the big picture and data protection is one corner of it. The increasingly rapid digital development in this era is increasingly forcing people to leave all conventional affairs, plus the unfinished pandemic condition that limit human movement in interacting with other humans. Today's life is all digital, which has been transformed in the 4.0 revolution era, making it easier to carry out all interaction. All exchanges of data and information flows that are increasingly efficient without wasting a lot of time are supported by all digital infrastructure that is very adequate to support the digitalization era. As the development of the digital era is getting faster and more efficient, one thing that needs to be considered is personal data. Personal data is crucial because it is very sensitive and very vulnerable to misuse. There are three reasons why data security is important. The first is to prevent potential material loss. The second is to reduce the risk of data or information misuse. The last is to reduce the chains of criminal action. Be aware of all forms of hacking and theft of personal data. Remember, personal data is a valuable asset for yourself. Never be rest in sharing any information related to personal data on social media because there is a very high risk of misuse of personal data. For that, we must know what are the ways that can be done to protect the safety of our personal data there are several types of ways in data privacy. Encryption is a process that changes a code from being understandable to an unreadable code. Encryption can also be interpreted as code or cheaper. A firewall is a security that is like a filter that aims to prevent access inside or out 
from unauthorized persons. Secure socket layers is a form of data encryption so that confidential information such as credit card numbers or authentication controls cannot be read or accessed by parties other than the owner and the server or service owner. Digital has dematerialized people. People have always been conscientious about their personal privacy. Personal privacy takes a new shape. Each person's right to privacy is more easily overthrown because we are not moving physical material around in space, but manipulating bits and bytes that compose a person. For that, we must know the importance of maintaining the security of personal data in digital rights and responsibility. So, that's all information that I can give to you. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. Bye-bye!